we had the best line though just a few minutes oh, ago. Oh yeah, we need uh, Tiffany's to be sponsoring this game. Blue boxes everywhere. We got two diamonds and one crystal in the building. And Dallas goes inside the tier. On a player like Diamond, who has length of her own. Well, Diamond Miller stops a 7 0 run by Dallas, who is just one of six in Tuesday's game for two points and only played 11 minutes. Last couple of games, she has struggled shooting the ball. Again, inside, Tara McCowan turns and scores. Who to take step back threes this year? Cheryl was asked for clarification on that, and she said, except for Rachel Bannum, she can do whatever yeah. she wants from the three point line. Nice pass inside. The championship, she's won the Defensive Player of the Year award, and at the beginning of the season, she talked about wanting to continue that as we see the whole board in court. One, the two, but when you keep the ball up, people can't get a touch on it. Oh, what a reverse with the left hand here. McBride and Collier that created that. How many times did we see that on Tuesday in the game? We saw it more flipped where right. Collier, or excuse me, we saw it just like that as we see. The last three games, Tierra McCowan's averaged 13 points, 13 rebounds. Here's what it takes. Having an incredible year. Here's Arike. She's been quiet. Minnesota's done a nice job on her. Tierra McCowan, the running right handed hook. Averaging 21 points per game between that bench, and they needed them badly in that last game. Soda able to get out to easy fast break point. Nice shot boxing out by Segris up ahead. Look at McCowan. Runs the floor. Trying to make this a dub here at home. They know playoffs are around the corner. High. Well, she also has a season high blocks. One off her career high in rebounds. The lead is three. Boy, Tierra says, just throw it up. I got it. And she does. 